Japan's Environment Ministry has compiled guidelines for the removal of radioactive materials discharged from the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. The 164-page guidelines with illustrations cover ways to measure radiation levels and remove radioactive substances. They also show how to collect, deliver and store radiation-tainted soil and other materials. The decontamination process will be different for buildings, roads, soil and plants. The guidelines recommend that water volume and pressure for decontaminating buildings should be adjusted as excessive amounts may cause the dispersion of radioactive materials. Wonderful. Wonderful. It says moss and dead leaves should be manually removed before high pressure sprays are used to save water. You must stop worrying. It adds that the used water should not be drained but collected in buckets. The guidelines propose the use of separate containers for different levels of radiation contaminated soil. They also give the safe distances of storage spaces from residential areas. Ministry officials say they hope the guidelines can facilitate the implementation of a plan to build temporary storage facilities, as residents will have a clearer idea of the decontamination process. My Officials from Japan's Environment Ministry say they will delay some decontamination work in Fukushima Prefecture. They've pushed back the cleanup of homes and farmland in the evacuation zones until late March. A law which takes effect next month requires the state to decontaminate areas of high radiation. The government is now using model projects to find the most effective way to achieve this. Spokespersons for the Environment Ministry have said they hope to start work on the restricted areas as early as January. They still expect workers to begin decontaminating infrastructure such as roads and reservoirs. But work on houses and agricultural land will be delayed. It will take time to get permission from evacuees to decontaminate homes and farmland. And it will be tough to secure temporary storage sites for contaminated topsoil. Honesty, I, it's a terrific concept. We don't know much about it. I want to get you on it. The government hopes to transfer all decontaminated soil to temporary storage by March 2014, except for areas with particularly high radiation levels. Sunday marks nine months since the massive earthquake and tsunami hit northeastern Japan on March 11th. Those that survived the disaster are now facing a harsh employment situation. In affected areas, more than 66,000 people were receiving unemployment benefits as of October. But for most of them, benefits will start to expire next month. In the hardest hit prefectures of Iwate, Miyagi and Fukushima, only 4,500 people found a full-time job in October. Although short-term employment is increasing, few companies have restored operations to pre-disaster levels. There aren't enough stable jobs to help rebuild the livelihoods of affected people. Meanwhile, the National Police Agency says the number of dead or missing from the disaster in the Tohoku region stood at 19,270 as of Friday. What's the problem? I haven't got a problem. I've got fucking problems. Plural. One away, eh? Sure. Well, most recently... Pictures presents 
the freak. This movie won't just scare you, it will fuck you up for life. Jaguar. For men who'd like hand jobs from beautiful women that you hardly know. Let's not lie, Steve. Let's level with America. We can't level, you crazy asshole. We're in advertising. So his company rewarded him by putting him in a mental facility. Hello, I'm William Holden. Hi. I'm Kathy. Hold me. Please hold me. Oh, oh, well, I am holding you. Oh, I know. It's a female thing. We say it a few times. Oh. We're maniacs! Ask who else! Who? But now the public is hooked on the honest cell. This honesty, I, it's a terrific concept. We don't know much about it. I want to get you on it. And Emery hey. can barely keep up with the demand. Until he gets a little help I'm quite visibly moved. from some people who can barely keep up with reality. We know you love him, but if he happens to die, we give you two Mercedes and a summer home. Wouldn't that be nice, too? John Hancock. Crazy people. I'm going to run some Caucasians down today. Yeah! Hey! You have to be a little nuts to tell the truth. Who here wants to be an ad man? Here wants to be a fire engine. Oh, 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 oh. Crazy people.